great news, everybody. I figured out, I, I've seen it a few times on YouTube, and people being able to make um, uh, objects transparent in ZBrush. But if anybody uses ZBrush and they have no idea what that is, or, or how to do that, then they're as confused as I was. But I just figured out how to do it. Okay, take any object you want, anything at all, like let's say, let's make this apparent water um, green. Okay, that, that's nice. But you can't see underneath the green, right? It's water, uh, so we're going to want to have uh, transparency. And I, I couldn't figure that out for the longest time, but I finally figured it out, and I'm so excited I'm going to celebrate somehow. Um, probably play a bunch of video games, but <coughs> until I do that, um, I'm going to show you guys how to do it in just a little bit. Okay, here, I just changed the color, and um, go down to Display Properties, right, and then BPR Transparent, enable that, right now, yeah, let's see, this probably won't work. I'm rendering the, okay, I rendered the background. It's um, fairly nice, but you can't see anything past the green. Uh, enable BPR transparent, and then go up to render, and then go to render properties, and enable transparent, right? Normally that's not active, but if you turn that on, apparently that works. So. Okay, now watch this. Fancy, fancy. I was so excited when I saw that. I was like, yeah, that's cool. Fun. Green's nice, but blue's, be blue's better. But yeah, that's really, really cool. So, yeah. That's all.